this morning I tell you I got rambling on my mind yeah. Oh, I'm gonna leave here this morning I tell you I got rambling on my mind I'm gonna leave all of my worries Leave this misery behind Hello, I am Jan James, and I am a blues soul singer, and I incorporate lots of um, positive emotion in the songs I write, and we like to have a good time. I'm going to take that train down to Montgomery, where I can be free. Blues is very important to the Chicago scene. I think mostly because the African Americans came up from the South and brought the the style of music with them, along with a little bit of country flavor, and landed in Chicago. And um, I'm just lucky enough to be influenced by it. I'm from Michigan originally, and don't don't listen to that. That's a song. It's not one I wrote actually, um, <laughs> but. Um, I'm lucky enough to be from Michigan, where I learned a lot about country blues and more on the, the um, what would you call it, the hillbilly side of life is what I learned it from. So, And then came to Chicago, well, through Detroit. Mm -hmm. We did a lot of rock and roll blues in Detroit and then came through to Chicago. So. You know, I like to bring it wherever I go. Yeah, one bullet burns another child to the ground. And now I call in all saints to heal them in Shy Town. We've written quite a few songs. Like I don't, know, I haven't, I haven't counted. But my new idea is I'm going to make a lyric book because a lot of people are asking for lyrics, and the lyrics are very important to me. So, I, you know, I think I want to put that forward and out there for people to to access, so that other people can play our songs and and be included in what we've created. Um, but I think there's a lot. I think there's ten CDs total, maybe eleven now. With the we made a Christmas album. <laughs> Yes, why not? <laughs> and now we're calling all saints to heal them in chat. Oh, we love you, Chicago. Yeah. People want to compare me with uh, someone like Janice because she's a white girl. She sings loud. Um, she has kind of a rock and roll vibe. Um, but she was a soprano. I'm a mezzo soprano. I mean, I can sing kind of high, but I don't sing that high. Um, and I, I write different kinds of music. I enjoy her, her work. Um, and it inspired me when I started, but I was inspired by more by, you know, Aretha Franklin and more by, uh, Patsy Cline and, people that, you know, kind of melded into my world. Muddy Waters was a big, I love the style of that music. And so to be compared to Janice is kind of just because it's an easy comparison just because of who I am, but it's not real. I mean, the close, you know, I played her in a, in a I was, a, I'm an actress too. So I, I did a show in Chicago, pretty big show called Love Janice. And I got to do the feathers and the glasses, and you know, I never really covered her music, so it was interesting to play that role. But it was it was different than who and what I do completely. So I, if you were going to describe it, I would say a little more country, a lot of soul, and positive energy. I guess I don't know. That kind of sounds weird, <laughs> but it but it's weird. I, I like to I like to sound, I like to feel like I'm in a real place and doing real connection with people. So many times I tried to walk away. You pull me back down. Now there's nothing I can say. I'm a gambler. Ain't nothing left for me to do. You 
know, there's terrible things. I mean, you know, Chicago, <laughs> there's a lot of gun violence in Chicago and it's terrifying and it's terrible and affects people in many levels all the time. And it's, it's heartbreaking, but I think to focus on the negativity of that is not really going to help anybody. I think my message in that song, and I, we may perform it here, um, is to call the saints within yourself and pull together the goodness in, that's in you and present it to the world and kind of try to find solutions that mean something in that way. Um, we have a new mayor now in Chicago, a new gay mayor lesbian mayor and she's uh she's formidable and i you know there's a lyric in the song it's mr mayor please do what you can please show them love doesn't have to or law doesn't have to have such a heavy hand but now it's got to be mrs mayor miss miss mayor miss mayor, <laughs> miss mayor. I, I can't make that miss mr mayor that's like da 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 you know missy mayor. Miss, lady mayor i don't know <laughs> we're gonna have to change that lyric but uh you know, we, we we do touch upon the problems, and there's a lot there, believe me. I think Black Orchid Blues was written when we found out who was going to be president, and I was just like, oh, what happened? That's the pain in that song. That That is some deep, deep pain that I tried to convey in that song. Um, and then um, Trouble with the Water. I'm from Michigan, and the there's a terrible crisis in this town in Michigan where they have all the lead pipes. and. The, anyway, the government made a huge mistake. The local, very conservative government tried to save some money, and they made a mistake. And you know, so many people have, yeah. And that's about that. And so we made a little video about that too. I don't know if you saw it. But it's on our website. Everything's on our website. It's been a long, long road, yeah. A long, long time. It is emotion, it is connection, it is uh, reaching down deep in and trying to iterate through voice for me, for guitar, for Craig, and instruments for other people, this deep connection that we have that's, uh, you know, kind of universal. It's like this energy that we all share. You know, there was some something I saw, I can't remember the name of it, it was a scientific explanation about music and blues and patterns and numbers and how they all kind of connect and how we we actually thrive on this one, four, five, I think it is. It's the, the connection of the, this chord progression and patterns that, that make me feel good. And even if it's you're talking about a tough subject, it still feels good. Right? You know, that's it. You know, it's like certain vocalists can take you to a place that you need to go to experience and to, to let things go and move through life happier.